it was about two seconds worth of me trying to fight the jet. It looked like it was spiraling into the ground. It started to slide to one side and the nose started to drop. I knew where the jet was going and I didn't want to be there with it, so I knew my only chance of survival was to, to pull the ejection handle. Uh, people ask, you know, how is it? Is that an easy decision to make or you must have really struggled with that decision? It was pretty obvious to me what I had to do. Uh, my perception was that I had turbulence and a downdraft. I added power, still was not happy with the situation, so I decided to add full power to climb away. Climbing away from the Alpha Pass is something that I had done 50 or 60 times so far in that season, um, but something that day went terribly wrong, as you all know. Uh, it became immediately obvious to me that the jet was not acting like it normally acts. Uh, I didn't know what the problem was at the time, but I tried to fight it, but I was not in control of the aircraft anymore. Uh, so I pulled the ejection handle, my, my training kicked in, I knew I had to do it. Uh, it's, it's something that we train to do, but um, it's rare to actually have to do it. So I pulled the handle and the ride started from there. Uh, the seat goes up the rails of the jet, powered by a catapult. At the top of the catapult, the rocket motor fires. It's almost 5,000 pounds of thrust in the seat, which carries me away from the aircraft. The parachute comes out about half a second later, and uh, I remember the whole flight. I remember in disbelief watching the canopy blow. I watched the jet turn onto its back and crash into the ground and explode. I watched the canopy hit the ground and then I hit the ground fairly hard after that. From pulling the ejection handle to me, it was only four seconds. And it was, uh, it, things just happened really quick. When I hit the ground, I felt pain in my spine. I knew that I, knew that I had a problem with my back. I didn't know if it was just a, a shock thing or what, but I decided that the best thing for me was just to lie there face down until help arrived. 